Here we go. I know exactly what you're thinking there, little Timmy Tim. I can hear your comment from a mile away. Ethan, how do you plan to do a bubblegum simulator noob to pro? There's too much content. <laughs> well, little Timmy, let me tell you. The noob to pro for bubblegum simulator is going to be anywhere between three to five to maybe even ten episodes. We are going to smash this simulator. No game passes, just good old fashioned big Bubble Boy 1337. Add me in game if you'd like, boys and girls. We are gonna kick it into this game. We're not gonna go crazy, all right? We're not gonna get secret pets or anything like that, but the plan is we're gonna unlock every portal in every three worlds, and we're gonna do it over multiple videos. In fact, let me just get started here while we're talking. Guys, my first ever Noob to Pro did really well. I did it on Dashing Simulator. I don't know if I've uploaded others before this one came out, but it did awesome, and it put me in a format that I really enjoy. I like playing simulators, so this works perfect for me, and I've been thinking about making an alt for opening eggs on Bubblegum Simulator. So I'm gonna have an alt now. Big Bubble Boy, 1337. Go ahead and add me. It's gonna be a long road. I don't know what every episode is gonna have in it, but today I would like to at least get some decent pets, maybe unlock some of the basic bubble prizes in here so we could hatch 100 eggs, probably not. But we could blow at least 100 bubbles. Maybe we'll blow 10,000 bubbles today. I don't know. But we're going to definitely unlock at least maybe the third portal in today's episode. Because in episode 2, I would like to be in Candyland. Okay? That's my goal for now. Episode 2, we will get to Candyland. First episode, we're going to set ourselves up. We're going to get the ball rolling. Leave a like down below if you're excited. If you enjoy this kind of comment, go ahead and subscribe. Because these videos take a long time to make. I need that community support so that we can keep on grinding. I'm also thinking in my blue team group, I might create a shirt for like 15 Robux that'll just be like big bubble boy and it might have a bubble on it because I'm thinking like people are really gonna get into this series, I hope. I hope you guys enjoy this series as much as me and I want you guys to be able to rep big bubble boy merch. I want you guys to be able to add this guy in game and if we get a little bit of Robux accumulated from selling those shirts, I could not look like a bacon hair. <laughs> I could spend some Robo and uh, make this guy look a little bit better. Can we buy anything already? So the first one is 175 for a higher capacity and 175 to blow bubbles a little bit faster. All right, what about our first pet? 250. I think it's better to just blow 100 and get ourselves that guy. Awesome. Okay, so we have a pet to start with. We have a panda. Equip that bad boy. Yes, eight bubbles at a time. All right, this is perfect. Now I can just stay in here and yes, okay, I just... It just pops in time. Nope, it doesn't. Bummer. All right, no, no, wait. We can upgrade our capacity now. Cool, so let's upgrade our capacity. I kind of hope that these videos can be seen as like... Oh, I upgraded the wrong one. No! <laughs> I kind of hope these can be seen as tutorials for people who get started with the game. Like, who people want to figure out how to, like, get good. Hopefully, I can help those people. I'm just going to have to blow bubbles really slow because it pops them too slow. Okay, so if you're new to Bubblegum Simulator, don't do what I did. Buy a new flavor first. Use your starter pet with a brand new flavor. Now I should be able to just AFK and blow bubbles in here, yeah? Please don't fill up. No, it's still not- uh, It's fine, it's fine. This is- This'll do. I am gonna smash this and be back with you guys when more is completed. So I haven't played the beginning of this game in quite a long time, but it looks like 550 bubbles is all you need to get to the, like, the first island. You probably could do it with less. I got the 551 for 4,000 and... Oh, yo. Yo, 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 don't do that to me, game. Don't do that to me. There we go. Yes, I've unlocked it. Okay, cool. This is easy money now. I'll be able to get some upgrades. I should probably... I'm gonna come back here in a minute. As you can see, I nearly have the 10,000 bubbles blown. So if I can blow the 10,000 bubbles, then we can have a better pet to get the chest with so we get more money overall. You know what I'm saying? Listen to my bacon face. I know things. All right, there we go. Let's go. Prizes. Is he any good? Oh, it's an epic. Oh, yes. Yo, 140 bubbles per blow. This game got easy, dude. Starting off in this game is a lot better than it used to be. Okay, I can dig it. 
How many now? Yo, I have 5,000. Please give me good money. Boop. 300k? No way, dude. What? I wasn't expecting that many. <laughs> That's great. Okay, uh, what can I buy for 300k? Actually, I think I need this. You can max this out. Okay, like, I know there's more shops later on, but Pog Champ, awesome. So I'm blowing 188 now. I jump much higher, so I kind of need to unlock the next area, huh? Yo, we're actually gonna make the next area already. This is amazing. That one chest, we did it. We discovered the twilight. So now we can sell our bubbles for twice as many. Pretty sure... I have got the next island in the bag. Yes, that is what we needed. Okay, now we can get legit gems. All right, let's grab these. Uh, what should I do? I think I'm gonna get a 17,000 egg first and then I'm gonna unlock this bad boy here just with a slightly better pet. All right, this is exciting. Bring it up, a real common, a good old common. Come on out. A unique pog, that's awesome. How many, come on. 400,000? Yes, that's so good. All right, now we can guess some real things. We actually did it. With 50,000 bubbles blown, I'm at the void. The only things above me now are like coins to gem exchange and XP island. Okay, so for any of you who might be trying to like learn how to play bubblegum simulator from this video, take a note. I made a very big mistake. So let me show you exactly what's going on. Also, I got my 5 million bubbles, got the legendary Electra, that times 985 gems is so good. So check this out, Toyland requires 50 mil to unlock. Beach World is 150 mil, so I assumed that I would just get started in the game, make my 50 mil, and unlock Candyland. A uh, nope. Candyland is unlocked always. You just get it from the beginning by the looks of it, which means the second that you can get to the first island in Candyland, you should start doing Candyland. Also, you sell for so much more here. I Like one bubble for four coins, and there's another shop here. Look, there's 850 mil 25 million capacity. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> so what you should do is immediately come into here and start collecting candies as well. Because like, if you're just blowing bubbles like me, you can get some basic candies, buy the first few eggs, get some basic pets, and then, because I can, I was able to get to all of the islands in the last area, so I should be able to get to the first candy island, which means I can do the first candy chest. Let's find out how much this is. So 400 to get the first guy. I don't know if that's even worth doing. I might just unlock the first area. So if we jump, we should definitely be grinding the candy as well, because this takes a lot longer. I think the candy area is probably the slowest of all of the areas, just because the chest farming itself isn't as good as the later ons, but boop, there we go. So we got Gumdrop Island. I'm half tempted to even go to the third level just so I can start trading gems for these guys, but let's get this. Okay, this doesn't really give you anything. All right, I'm gonna do the, this might be a dumb thing to do, but let's go, boop, we got a thousand. That'll do, we'll open a couple of chests, we'll get some basic pets, and that way next time we come here in like 30 minutes, I'll get a lot more. Okay, I've only gotten uniques, that's great. <laughs> so if we go back out, I got three uniques, but they're all five times candy, which is great. That's really good news for us. So I, you need to start grinding candy immediately. Don't do what I did. And now with our brand new Electra and our three Void Dragons, which are pretty awesome. Actually, I think one of them's, they're all Void Dragons? No, that's a Void Demon. Okay, so I wish I had three Void Dragons. I've only got two. The Void Dragon is better than the Void Demon by a fair bit. So how much do we get? Seven mil, nice. 19 mil already. All right, we're gonna be able to do some decent upgrades here. Give me three mil gems. Nine million, whoa! What? I wasn't expecting that. I've only got one legendary pet. Come on, dude. I haven't played this game that much. So what's this gonna give me, 15 mil? 27? Whoa. Also, I did unlock the upstairs area here. I went all the way up to this area, so because leveling up your legendaries is really good for them. So I'm gonna, every time I come up here, I'm just gonna run the Electra through this area. So he's already level four. I would love to max level this guy. Uh, I probably won't because I feel like, look at that, it's already 1.1 now instead of 900. I feel like I can just uh, get better pets, but that'll do. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so to finish off today's video, my plan is I'm just gonna open a bunch of eggs and then I'll come back if I get anything good, I'll show it to you guys. And if not, that will be the end of part one. So rewatch this if you need to, if you want to learn how to play. It's going to be a slow progress, but we are going to go from noob to pro in maybe five videos. If you're hyped to that, 
please leave a like, comment, share it with your Robloxian friends, and of course, join the blue team group on Roblox. It's pretty mad lad stuff. Come on, give me like a Dark Phoenix. Give me one of the legendaries out of here. That would be awesome. All right, so I pretty easily managed the reward island here in Candyland. I'm pretty sure I can actually make it to all of them, but this is the one I was curious about. So let's finish this off. So if I was to start unlocking these, I don't think I would get Candy Pet for a very long time. I think that radioactive bear... I think that's the first candy pet, which is pretty decently away. I might even, I might be better off just getting the big chest, trying to get some basic pets, maybe a first legendary for Candyland, and then try and get the radioactive bear. Alrighty guys, well that is gonna do it for the first episode of Noob to Pro in Bubblegum Simulator. I hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free to leave me tips and tricks in the comment section down below. You want to help me out and of course add Big Bubble Boy 1337 join the blue team group. I will be releasing a t-shirt inspired by Big Bubble Boy so you guys can fully support the series. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all next time. Yeah.